Hello everyone. I went to the Dollar Tree. Really good stuff. Again, my favorite place to shop. I have a nice Dollar Tree haul that I hope you guys will enjoy. And there's new items. This is a big haul. I have it. I have a bench right here. I have everything on my bench. So we'll get started with these. These are zipper pockets, and I thought they'd be good for tax receipts for my daughter's business. So they have separate, they have a zipper here. This one's like a lime green, and it has these grommets to put in a folder. Um, so it has two zippers, one right here. That could be for lunch receipts or food. This could be for materials, the big one. And then you can stick it right in a folder. I really like the orange one, same thing. So I thought this could be for April and this could be for May. So those were a really good find. I've seen these at some other stores and they're $7.99 a piece. So I thought that was a great find along with these pens. These are called Roller 2. They're rollerball pens and they're black. And these, um, these are expensive, but at the Dollar Tree you get two for a dollar. I have these in blue and I love them. So I'm gonna give that to my daughter. Let's see what else. There's really no order. I'll do the books last. I found some really nice books. So Reynolds Wrap at the Dollar Tree. I mean, it's 15 feet, but Reynolds Wrap at my grocery store for 40 feet, um, it's $8 or $9. So I thought, you know, for camping, the camper, or I just needed it, so I thought that was a good value. The, the Dollar Tree, um, the other brand, the Red Box, it's a dollar, it's 40 feet, but it's so thin, it just tears and rips and it's kind of aggravating, so I wouldn't recommend that. The Reynolds Wrap is the best. Um, I found Panasonic batteries, so for remotes or when you're in a pinch, and these are double A, four for a dollar. I thought that was a good value. I needed this. I was out. I don't know. If, I don't know about you, but when I'm out of this, I panic because I have to spray my crock pots, my pans. And this is Healthy Chef Canola No Stick Cooking Spray, and it's five ounces. I don't know if this is new or not, but that'll last. A long, long time. Uh, let's see. Love this. Have you guys tried this? So they're little granules you put in your washing machine to make the, this is a uh, spring. So this makes your laundry room smell heavenly. Uh, the other one I had was, I think it was a clean, fresh scent. It was blue. So let's smell this one. Mmm, it smells so springtimey and floral, but not too strong. So I love, I love that. I'm excited to try that scent. I found, I think this is face cream, Pond's face cream. And it's got, I'm going to smell it. I'm going to open it up. So this is a good amount. Let's see, and it's thick. Oh, it's nice and thick, the consistency. Yep, it smells like ponds. So I thought that would be a good night cream to try. Night cream, my night cream that I use, Elizabeth Arden, it's $105 for the same ounces as this but I'll give this a shot and I'll let you guys know how that is. 
and it's not heavily scented. It says light moisturizer. So we'll try that. I'll let you guys know about that. My husband's favorite deodorant. He likes the clear because it doesn't stain his white, black t-shirts and white t-shirts. And that is lime, aluminum free. That's important. Aluminum free. Aluminum is bad for you. Irish Spring, you get two full-size bars for a dollar. I thought that was a good value. And these are my favorites. I'm on the keto diet. If you guys um, have been watching my prior videos, I started January 1st and I've lost 17 pounds. My husband started it last week. We weigh in once a week and he came upstairs, the scales downstairs. He came upstairs and he said, I'm not doing this diet. I only lost 10 pounds. He lost 10 pounds in one week on the keto diet. And this is keto friendly. This is called Power Blend Imperial Nuts. It has peanuts, salted almonds, pistachios, filberts, and walnuts. So this is three servings per bag. And the net carbs, let's see what the net carbs is. Uh, three. So you take the total carbohydrates on the keto diet, you minus the fiber, so there's five grams of carbs, two grams of fiber, so that equals three net carbs. You can see that. So this is a good snack for me at night when I'm watching TV, when I'm watching my Hallmark channel. Okay, and then for my little granddaughter, isn't this adorable? This little heart-shaped book. It says, I love my dad. Aw. I'm going to read it to you guys. He gives me yummy snacks when I'm hungry. There's the page. He tells me jokes and makes me laugh. My cats are listening to this story over there. I wouldn't have it any other way. So cute, and the pictures are adorable. A little hippo there. There's the back. I don't know if there's a series of these heart-shaped books. If you know, let me know down below in the comments. And then my daughter loves to read these. It's called The Little Book of Bedtime Stories. So last time, if you remember, I had the Peter Pan one, which is being um, canceled. And look at the pictures. Daisy's first adventure. Lawrence goes adventuring. Cute. Yeah, so these are nice bedtime stories, just the right length to keep a child's interest, I think. Good, nice little hardcover. What else? This Hansel and Gretel. I think I've hauled this before, I'm not sure, but I have several grandchildren, so um, I'm gonna give this to my grandson, James, for his mom to read him. And then, let's see. Look at you guys. Look at this huge, beautiful cookbook. It's called the Boston Homegrown Cookbook. And this was $33 and it was a dollar and the pictures are gorgeous. Spring, summer, fall and winter recipes. The pictures are amazing. I love putting these different cookbooks on the coffee table for people when they come over to read. Let's see, there's any good. So homegrown cuisine right from the farm. Look at the pictures, wow. Olena, huh, Olena. 
So it looks like there's different farms along with their recipes. Farm to table recipes. Lane's lobster salad, mmm. Smoked tomato gazpacho. So that looks amazing. I can't believe I found that. That was the only one, but I still don't know where they get their cookbooks. Okay, so this is interesting. It's called Summer. And this was $30. I'll read a little bit of it. And it completely, it's completely dark out now. It is 23 minutes to midnight. And you have already slept for four hours. What will you dream of tonight? No one will ever know. Even if you were to remember it when you wake up, you wouldn't have a language in which to communicate it to us. Nor do I think that you quite understand what dreams are. I think that is still undefined for you. Your thoughts haven't grasped the concept yet and therefore lives within the strange zone where it neither exists nor doesn't exist. So that looks interesting. It's about dreams. And believe me, I have some weird ones. I actually remember my dreams. Okay, you guys, look at this. Joan Collins. Remember her? Yeah, Dynasty. I think she's still alive, isn't she? Is she? I think her sister passed away, Jackie Collins. I'm sure she did. This is called Misfortunes. Misfortunes Daughters. I actually didn't know she wrote books. I thought just her sister Jackie did. This was $23.95. It says Joan Collins's powerful new novel in a highly charged family saga, writ with sibling rivalry insatiable, ambitious, eroticism, and addiction. So I'm excited to read that. When was this written? Let's see. I wonder if it's an old book. Oh, look at it. She has other, the same author. Look at all the books she's got under her belt or under her dress or under her skirt. Those are Quite a few books under her skirt, I had no idea. It's for my darling husband, Percy. So this is copyrighted in 2005. I have to Google if she's still alive. Does anyone know? Let me know down below. Let's see. Anything else? Nope. So that is my haul. Um, if you guys have any comments or suggestions or any books that you've um, had from the Dollar Tree, let me know if they're any good, if you read them, and I will search for them. Sometimes if someone gives me a good book that they read from the Dollar Tree, I'll just go ahead and order it from Amazon because I'm an avid reader. I read every single night. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna go take Julie out to lunch, my daughter and the baby. We're gonna go um, downtown have lunch um, in a little town in Wisconsin. So have a great day. Um, I am going to go to the Dollar Tree with her today. So we'll see what we get for the next haul. Thanks again, you guys.